how pretty that water is. Okay, so we have left our cute little French chalet and we are on our way back to Switzerland for Jacob. He's having a special experience today, um, but we stopped in a town called Anse. We are going to the most delicious pizza place that my sister has ever eaten at. And so we're taking a little break. It's on the way to Switzerland and um, walking along this river. Oh my goodness, <gasps> look at this. So this little walkway reminds me of um, Russia. So if you go check out our video from when Jojo and I were in Russia, long time ago, like almost five years ago, um, you will see what I'm talking about. And it's actually where my sister and her husband and family lived for five years um, that we are with right now. So here's the link to that video. You can go check it out. And there was a car on here. <laughs> Crazy, right? Hey, lady. Hi. Hey. <laughs> we're a little bit lost, but uh, we're enjoying this little walk, this little jaunt in this cute little town. And then I think we'll find it here soon. Oh, there's Nelly and Johnny. They know where they're going. Oh my goodness, Grace, what did you find? Do you love it? Oh my goodness, Gigi Ami. You're so cute. Yay! I think they found it. They're just going off of what they remember. They don't actually know. So we're excited to try. Oh boy, you guys got your own table. How's the pizza, Sam? Mm -hmm. This is so good. Yeah, it's delicious. Do you love it, Grace? You have to cut the pizza. And juicy as can be. I've never had a pizza this juicy. That was delicious. We are done. Now we are walking to the car and going to the Schweiz. One thing that we're just absolutely not used to is how early everything closes. On this little street, everything closes at two or three. So we <laughs> barely made it to the restaurant. And everyone's just like closing up. I'm like, I just, we're not used to that. We're not, like, it seems like, it, it seems like in America, like, it's all about, like, making as much money as possible. And so you stay open as late as possible and you stay open as long as you can to the point where you don't lose money. But here, it just seems like more, it's like out of quality of life or, or just, they don't care about that. That's when they want to close. And it's, it, it's just interesting. All right, we learned a lesson today. Uh, this, of course, is a great minibus, but it takes diesel. And we did not know about AdBlue. We now know about AdBlue. Uh, our car, we pull up here, we park for a minute, and then I tried to start it and it wouldn't start. So come to find out, you have to put AdBlue with diesel. I guess it gets rid of some of the bad exhaust or something like that. We did call road, roadside assistance. Uh, thankfully, Johnny 
uh, and Shad knew how to help us. Shad knows all about diesels. So he said, oh yeah, this add blue, you gotta add it in. So we poured it in and it started and we were so grateful. Uh, otherwise we were gonna need roadside assistance. Where are you going, Jake? Temple. Temple? Cool, for your first time? Yeah. Hey, turn around and talk to the camera. Yeah. You excited? Yeah. I'm excited for you. Where are you? In Bern. I'm in Zollikofen. In Switzerland? Yeah. We're excited, grateful we're with you. Yeah. Yeah, we've got uh, Isaac's family joining us. Is that them? Hopefully they're here. Is that them in the front? I don't know. Oh, maybe. So, this will be awesome to have family join our family for Jake's first time. And to be in Switzerland for the first time. Alright Jake, how was it? Good. Good? Was it fun? Yeah. Do you feel cool and special? that all these people are here for you. Yeah. <laughs> we are at the Sterner shop and it is our favorite. It's just down the road. And so we had to bring everybody. They've been so kind to us and giving us like free stuff and like just so grateful that we come. It's been really awesome. We're gonna miss this little shop and we're grateful we get to come at least with Nally and Johnny before they fly out tomorrow. It's crazy. We'll have to say goodbye. believe how much cheaper it is to see the doctor and to get prescriptions here it's so much more expensive in the US it's crazy so I'm so grateful um, and anyway yeah we got three prescriptions and it was very reasonably priced um, and so the doctor said if this doesn't work within a few hours then she may need to go to the hospital my guess is this is all she needs and she'll be fine. Um, we're definitely open. You know, we will. So I, I feel like this is all that she'll need and she'll be good to go. Um, so I'm just grateful for people who were able to be available to take her um, at a last minute appointment to see her, to fill her prescriptions, and to use their best English to explain uh, what is wrong and, and what she needs. Um, I really, really appreciate everyone who's helped today. Okay. 
Okay. Yay! Look who's so feeling here. so much so better. In there. Grace, are you feeling so much better? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, here we go. I don't know if you can hear her wheezing. We just got done. She's got to put this on her mouth like that. Yeah, she doesn't like it. She's got to put it on her mouth like this and inhale. I hope I hope she's fine. Um, doctor said if she's worse, she needs to go to the hospital, get her chest x-rayed. My gut feeling is that she is good. I feel like we've got everything we need for her to get better and where she's had more energy. She's been playful tonight. Um, her breathing is still labored. Um, she's still wheezing really bad. Um, so that does worry me. I'm just like, oh. And me! <laughs> so just prayers that she's doing well because we fly out in the morning. And because if she isn't doing better, we don't really have. So we're going to get her to bed and uh, wake up in the morning and fly all day and all night. Yay for that.